guys welcome back to another vlog i'm putting my hair up right now my hair looks crazy so don't mind it it's like all slicked i have a hair serum in my hair i'm gonna wash my hair later so i did the serum today i've talked about this before but it's my favorite the goop restore and shine hair serum it's so good so i'm doing this right now and i'm not gonna shower quite yet but uh, anyway welcome back to another vlog Make sure you're subscribed if you're not already. Follow me on Instagram. I always have it linked down below. And I'm very excited for these next few days because I'm going to be vlogging. And then I'm going to vlog a little bit at the wedding and post that after. So you guys will be able to see a little behind the scenes of the wedding. I'm going to try to vlog just like maybe do more of like a montage video because I don't, I want to be present and in the moment, but I do still want to get some footage and have like all those memories and stuff because I know that I'm going to want to look back on it and I also want to get it from like the guest point of view for Rachel's wedding for her to see and get clips of like her and Dylan and her family and try to do like behind the scenes stuff like that so she can see it as well because I know she's probably going to be so busy and I want her to be able to like see everything after it's done so i'm going to try to do that so make sure you're subscribed so you don't miss out on any of the upcoming videos i'm very excited i have never been to a wedding before it's so weird because the only wedding i've ever been to is my mom was my mom's wedding and she got married to my stepdad in august of 2019 and they had more of like a chill wedding like it wasn't anything like crazy it was just like very chill family like close friends on the cape so i'm excited this is like my first official wedding and um, mac is coming with me and jess is going and bren and andy and lily and we're staying at jess and bren's house so i'm very excited about that it's monday right now it's actually 6 19 i gotta clean up the kitchen because the kitchen is a mess i have like a bunch of dry cleaning that i picked up that I need to put away. I did laundry over the weekend that I need to put away and like finish folding and stuff. But I just wanted to show you guys a few things that I picked up today, which I am so excited about. I want to try out my new makeup that I got in my last vlog. I picked up some makeup from Sephora and I want to do like a little makeup tutorial and try out my new product. Sorry, I'm like trying to set you guys up on my paper towel holder. So I'll be able to show you guys all the stuff that I got. Hopefully this angle isn't too bad. Sometimes I set the camera up and it's like from way down below. And I literally have a double chin. And I'm like, why do I do that to myself? Like I literally do it to myself. But anyway, I am really excited because I have all of my outfits picked out for the wedding. Which I want to try on tonight because I do want to order like a pair of earrings for one of my outfits and then I think an anklet for the other outfit. So I'm gonna try those on later and show you guys, but I have this new Hourglass liquid foundation, liquid powder foundation mattifying by Hourglass in the shade Shell. Emma told me that she uses this and she always has like flawless airbrush skin when she wears makeup, so I got this. And then I also got the Makeup Forever Ultra HD Micro Finishing Loose Powder. She said that this is so good for under eyes, so I got these. And then I also got this lip, which I think is gonna be really pretty. I wanna do my full makeup and like make sure that I am bringing just like the products that I need. I don't wanna like overpack and bring a ton of stuff, so I wanna like try it out to see if I like it before I go to Florida. And then I also got two of my Armani Luminous Silk foundations. I get 5.5 and 5, and I like to mix the two shades because 5.5 is perfect for when I have a spray tan and I have like a really dark tan, and then 5 is like my more natural shade. But when I'm in between, I like to mix them. And I also picked up two things from Bottega today, which I'm really excited about. I went to the Bottega in Boston, and I got a pair of heels, and I got a bag because I personally... I'm obsessed with the Bottega heels specifically. I'll show you guys the ones that I got. I got these. They're the stretch heels with the straps. These heels are the perfect heel height. I don't know exactly how tall they are, but I think that they are just like amazing for when you're gonna be on your feet a lot. They're super comfy. Also, they are obviously pricey since they are a designer shoe, but I just think that they're so comfortable. I have these in white, which are getting repaired right now because Milo destroyed them, chewed them up, which is my fault. So those are getting repaired, but I also have them in black and I've had them for 
like over two years and they're still in such good condition and I just think that they're such like a classic timeless heel so I got these ones right here which are like a bronze and I really really love them and the heel also like isn't super short I feel like when I tried on like shorter heels which I did earlier they just like don't make my legs look long and I don't like that but I also don't like when heels are super high so these are the best heels i really really love bottega heels and i just think that they're such a great investment in my opinion um and they also have like a bunch of dupes out there of heels that look like this so i picked these up and then i also got another mini jody and it looks black on camera but it's like a chocolate espresso brown and i think that looks so good it really is not picking up the color on the camera but it's like a chocolate brown and I'm gonna wear it with this black strapless silk dress from Beckenbridge which I'm gonna try on for you guys later but those are two things that I got today and also the worker at Bottega gave me a perfume for free and I was like I really really like it um so I'm really excited about this but those are two things that I picked up okay I need to I need to feed Milo because he's getting a little antsy but i just want to show you guys what i got today from bottega and matt got his outfit and i'm so excited he looks so good in it and i can't wait for the wedding and like the night before and it's gonna be a lot of fun so yeah guys i did not vlog last night graydon ended up coming over for dinner and we did a i don't even know what i guess like the dish is called that i made but i posted it on my instagram story i saved it to like my food highlight and it was like a beef you know what i'm just gonna show you guys and also i linked the recipe that i use so if you follow me on instagram definitely make it because it was so good but this is what it looked like it was like rice like a jasmine coconut rice with beef and broccolini and then green onion and some sesame on top and like a really yummy sauce so that was really good and usually Graydon comes over on Wednesday but he came over on Monday because Mac and I are gonna leave tomorrow night so Wednesday night we fly to Florida for Rachel's wedding and the flights were kind of weird going from Boston to the part of Florida that we're going to because no matter what we have to have a layover so we are leaving Wednesday night like later in the day and then getting there late at night instead of leaving thursday early in the morning and getting there like mid-afternoon so i'm really excited about that but that means i have to pack today which i'm gonna get into in a little bit i just made some breakfast tacos had my coffee and now i need to get organized and i want to do some work before i pack and get all that stuff ready because i mainly have like everything done like i know the outfits that i'm wearing also i already got my nails done and i'm gonna get a pedicure in the morning which won't take long at all so i feel like all i have to do is just like put my stuff into my suitcase there's really not a lot of stress i feel like this trip but i made a lemon water and i'm gonna sit on the couch and make some favorites lists on revolve because i want to do like different <laughs> list for you guys because i did a graduation dress one and then like a wedding guest list but i have a big list on my phone of um like different lists that you guys asked me to make on instagram i did like a little poll so i'm gonna sit down this morning and do that also i've been like waiting to wash my hair i don't think i'm gonna wash it until tomorrow because uh, tomorrow's the day that i leave so i apologize if i look a little bit crazy i haven't even done my skincare yet <sighs> but i'm gonna sit down and do this also i'm really excited because i did like a big spring summer order on revolve sorry you can't even see me but i'm really excited because i did a big spring summer order on revolve and it is coming tomorrow i hope that it comes before we leave for the airport because i ordered two pairs of birkenstocks 
and I really want to wear one and bring one with me because I just feel like they're like the perfect sandal and I swear Birkenstocks are going to be like the shoe of the summer at least for me that they are but I'm really excited I'll show you guys the ones that I got I got this pair right here it's like a cute little tan pair and then I also got these which I think are so fun with the strap I also love the white I added all this stuff to my revolve favorites which is always linked down below but there's like such good stuff right now I really want to get a pair of converse and there's just a few things that I'm gonna I think order but I'm gonna go ahead and make these lists and I will link them down below so you guys can check them out if you're interested I want to get a little bit of packing done before I start dinner and stuff so I'm gonna try on some outfits and show you guys what I'm packing for the wedding since our flight is tomorrow night so this is my dress for the first night which is Thursday there's nothing like official for the wedding plan that night we're just gonna do dinner at one of the restaurants in Rosemary Beach and then we are probably gonna um, meet up with like Rachel and stuff for drinks after, but we don't know like what the plan is yet. So we have dinner and this is the dress I'm gonna wear. It's like open back, it's super cute. It's from Rat and Boa and I just love the colors and I feel like it's perfect for like being at the beach. I love it. Okay, this outfit I showed in a vlog last week, but this is my outfit for the bridal brunch and I don't know if I'm gonna wear this cult guy a necklace with it yet because someone commented on my video and said that it's giving Mrs. Flintstone or some character from the Flintstones and now like I can't unsee it. So I might wear it with my actual cult guy dress that I'm wearing Friday night to the beach party but I am gonna try it on after and see how it looks but this dress is for the bridal brunch like I said and my heels are from Femme LA they are very tall but honestly they're so comfy and so flattering I love the way that they make like my feet and my legs look and this dress is super cute orange with the open back the theme of the party is like orange you have to wear orange or pink so I chose this dress. And then for my bag, I think I'm just gonna do my little tan and gold YSL bag. This outfit is for the Friday night beach party. And my dress is gold from Colt Gaia. I love it. And then I'm gonna use the brown Bottega bag with it. And I'm just gonna do like gold jewelry, my hair up, and I think I'm gonna leave like a few pieces down and do like beach waves in the front. But this is the dress, it's like open back. It's so cute, I love it, and I'm wearing it in a size small for reference. Also, the orange dress is a medium, and then my Rat and Boa one that I tried on that's like multicolor, that one is a size medium as well. And this is the dress I'm wearing on the wedding day. It's from Beckenbridge, it's a strapless maxi dress, and I'm wearing the Bottega heels with it, and then also the bag that I just showed you guys, the brown one from Bottega. These little pieces of fabric in the back are kind of annoying like there's just a lot of fabric back there which kind of makes the front of the dress look a little weird but it's really cute I love this dress it comes in so many different colors and I feel like it's like the perfect dress if you're like a wedding guest I just love like the simplicity of it and also the fit of it is very flattering as well for a plain silk dress it like fits your body nicely I'm making Mac and I a green juice and we've honestly had this at like every single day for the past week and it's so good I used to make this a lot in my vlogs last year but basically what you do is I like to blend my juices and I do spinach cilantro celery cucumber I'm doing a lot because we're leaving tomorrow and I need to use everything and I don't want to waste, so we have two pieces of ginger, and then I'm going to squeeze two lemons.
I just came to Saks really quick and I've been eyeing this bag for the longest time on forward and I want to get it for the Florida trip so I came to pick it up. I'm waiting in the, oh, so here it comes. I'm waiting for Mac because he just got a shirt from State and Liberty on Newberry and I'm gonna go pick up some um, skincare stuff from Alexis. Just got back home. I wanna show you guys the skincare stuff that Alexis gave me and then also I wanna show you the bag that I got as well. I need to set you guys up again on my little paper towel roll. Like acts as my tripod. You would think that I have a tripod around here, but I literally don't. So this is the bag that I got. I will link it for you guys. But yeah, I just thought that this would be perfect for summer as like a tote. Like obviously, like obviously a tote. Um, like for the beach, for day to day. I'm excited to use it in Florida because I'm gonna be carrying so much stuff around. I feel like like hats, sunscreen, sunglasses, my camera, just like always have to have everything. And I don't wanna be like trying to stuff everything in a little tiny bag like I always do. So I'm really excited about this bag. It's really cute. And then I also got, this is what I got for skincare will link. Alexis's store down below for you guys because you can shop her skincare and that's the only place that you can get these exact products from because she will ship them out to you from her office. So I got this face mist which I already used and it's supposed to make your face like firm. It's a copper firming mist by IS Clinical. And then she also gave me this warm honey cleanser. Another cleanser to try. And then, what is this? Oh, SPF 30, which is going to be perfect for Florida. And then she gave me this Alto Advanced Defense and Repair Serum. This is by Skin Better Science. I love their serums. This is like a vitamin C serum, their Alto is. I like to use it, honestly, morning and night. And I ran out of Alto a while ago, so I have like needed a new one but she wanted me to wait until their Alto Advanced came out, which is this product right here, and it's their new Alto. So, I'm really excited to try this out. And then, last but not least, oh! And then last but not least, I'm so excited about this. The face light, Emma uses this, and she like swears by it, and I'm very, very excited. It's legit, this like mask that you put on, and you sit with the LED light. On. It's supposed to just like really be really really nice on your skin. I don't think I'm gonna bring this with me to Florida, although I do. I'm like tempted and I do want to. I just know that it's just gonna take up space and I'm probably not gonna use it. Um, but I'm really excited to come home and use that after. So yeah, that's everything that I got. I'll link everything down below for you guys. I'm finishing up packing my day stuff. I'm doing. Hunza G bikini for one of the days. I honestly love these bikinis and I feel like I've been kind of like making a change towards wearing like more um, of the bikinis from this brand because they're just so comfortable and also I love how they're not like complete thongs because I am going to be like with my boyfriend, Jess, her husband, Lily, her boyfriend. It's just like I don't need to be walking around in a thong bikini <laughs> with all of these other guys around you know what I mean so these are they have definitely more coverage so I'm gonna bring this purple one matching scrunchie I just don't know what bucket hat to bring I think I honestly might bring both I'm trying to keep my color palette very similar I know it sounds crazy but I just feel like it looks best on my Instagram feed <laughs> and also I just like when everything like matches and I can like mix and match things together you know so I have that, and then I'm gonna use this new makeup bag. We're gonna pack my makeup in a second. I got this from Stony Clover, and these are so good, you guys. I'll link them down below. So good, and I have my Skims sets for sleeping, which I'm gonna bring, and then I have two t-shirts and a pair of yoga pants, which I think I'm gonna wear on the plane home. A white sweatshirt, and then over here I have all of my dresses packed so far. So we have the Rotten Boa, the Colt Gaia, all the dresses that I need. And then I have these silk beachy pants, which I'm gonna bring a linen 
button up and then this really cute Aritzia, it's like a shorts um, little like jumper thing. So that's what I have so far. Um, I'm gonna pack a few more things for daytime, just like maybe little tops and more silk pants, just for like a more relaxed outfit when like we go grab coffee in the morning and stuff. I'm packing all of my makeup into the Stony Clover bag and I have brand new foundations that I'm bringing. Oh, I think I said it earlier in the video. I never actually got to like try on the makeup and see how I liked it. So I'm just gonna kind of wing it. But I'm also bringing this RMS highlighter. It's like a body, um, face and body powder. And then I have a brand new Charlotte Tilbury setting powder. This is my favorite setting powder. So I'm gonna bring this brand new one with me. And then also I have to bring Charlotte Tilbury um, sharpener for my lip liners, which I have two Pillow Talk lip liners. These are my favorite. And then this is my normal makeup bag that I use, but by Bays, and I'm gonna switch to this one right now just because I have like new stuff that I wanna bring. And I have to bring my favorite lip gloss. I'm bringing that. Okay, this is my blush. I was gonna like wash all of my makeup before I brought it, but I honestly didn't even have time to do that. So I'm just gonna throw everything in here. because I wanted to just like freshen up before the flight since the flight is at 5.45, but I have everything mostly packed. I wanna show you guys an update of the packing situation because I ended up switching over my skincare to this other Sony Clover bag. They're just so big, I really like them, so I switched to this one. And then I got this really cute Bays jewelry case and it comes with like a little tray that you can like put all of your jewelry out once you get to your destination. So this is really cute. I have all my sunglasses, perfume, hairspray, beach bag. And then I have a disposable camera, brush, underwear, socks, stuff like that. And then all of my supplements. This stuff has like my chargers and editing stuff. And then I have my makeup in here. Clothes are all packed up in the packing cubes. And then I have all of my bags and shoes in the dust bags. I'm just gonna go ahead and then put these right here. Okay, we're all packed up and I'll show you guys a little airport outfit of the day I have on just this little top from Revolve. I love it. It's really soft, I'll link it for you guys. It's a long sleeve. And then I'm wearing Lululemon yoga pants, flare, and then my Princess Polly leather jacket over it just because I didn't want to wear, like I didn't know what to wear over it. I didn't want to like honestly wear a sweatshirt because sometimes I feel like frumpy unless it's like an early flight. So I just threw this on and it's very lightweight. And then I'm gonna just wear my easy slides and I have little socks on too.